Yo guys and girls, my name is Elijah Starship, and today in this video we are going to be playing the PS4 version of Spelunk E. Now if you don't know what Spelunk E is, it's basically a hardcore, endless, not endless, it's a part hardcore, which means if you die, you start from the very beginning, you don't start where there's a checkpoint, basically, the beginning, <coughs> sorry, the checkpoint, so yeah, so we're, I am playing, again, the PS4 version, now if you guys do want me to play more Spelunky or any other games for the PS4, PS3, maybe PC if I find a good recorder by the time you watch it. So I'm going to smack that like button and subscribe to the Starship with All Stars. And again, if you want me to play anything else, post that in the comments. So yeah, so let's get straight into it. So yeah, basically every time you die, the levels change a little bit with different enemies. And yeah, so I've played this before. I'm going to be starting a new game. So yeah, I love this little menu. It has little spears for the... Um, like selection. So yeah, so I'm gonna click play game, and we're going to be playing adventure, which says embark on a quest for one millisecond. I don't know, one millisecond. What is that? It's like zero one m. I don't know. Legendary treasure, go alone or with friends. And then there is the <coughs> daily challenge. Compete against other online explorers in today's adventure. You only got one shot, kid. It doesn't say kid, but I just added kid. And then, there is Deathmatch. Nope. Uh, so, compete in a deadly competition to see who's the most skilled in the adventurer. But we are going to be playing Adventure, which is like the main story, basically. So, I'm going to click it. And... Yeah, so basically, it's up to four people, and I'm just going to be doing one person since I'm alone today. And there's a bunch of different characters that you can play as, and there's a lot of characters, so I'm guessing you have to, um, I forgot what I was going to say. You have to, like, beat the story with a certain one to unlock it or something. So yeah, there's a lot of characters I didn't even count. So, I'm going to be playing as the robot, which you might have saw, seen, might have seen, yeah, so basically you just click it, click X, and you start climbing down, you get, there's a battery in the back, which is probably a really stupid place to put it, you know. so today's video I'm going to be playing the tutorial, which is that little cave where the Chinese guy, maybe? Asian, I'm just gonna say Asian guy, and yeah, so you can move around. There's a jump, there's a crouch that you can look up, yeah. So we're going to, and this is the this ladder here is actually a little sort shortcut since I've already played this game before. There's little shortcuts, and they're the first area, just like the cave. And then there's a jungle and then a snow area after that. So I'm guessing there's four air five areas, because the cave, jungle, snow, and two more, I'm guessing. So yeah, so I'm not gonna be using the skip. And yeah, so I'm going to be starting with the tutorial. And if we have time, I'll be starting the main thing. Actually, uh, should I start the tutorial? Yeah, yeah, I'll start with the tutorial. Yeah, so you just click L1. <coughs> Greetings, my name, my name is Yang, and this is my journal. Dusty maps and rumors of amazing treasures have led me here deep under the desert. There's something very strange about this place. The layout seems to change all the time. I've never seen the same room twice. It could be the legendary curse of Olmac. Oh, that's a name. That's an L. I thought that was a one. Curse of Olmac, the one they say traps people inside the caves forever. 
I push the idea out of my mind and focus on the treasure ahead. If I master the basics of movement and combat, I wouldn't leave here a rich man. And there's a little snake. And I call him Jeffrey. So yeah, tutorial one. And you have four lives, which you see kind of in the corner. And there's bombs, there's rope, there I have zero dollars right now. So yeah, so let's just get going. And there's the jump jump up and then you jump on the ledge and it's like basically a Mario style where you, you have to jump on their head and they die and I, since I have played this before I know what to do and if you click R1 you start moving really fast it's like a sprint and you try to gain as much money as you can and see there's there's the little tutorial pad and there is a whip that you can use square with crouches and there's and if you crouch far enough then you can look farther down. So, yeah. So I did get this free for the PlayStation Plus download. It was a long time ago this one. Oh I I fell. So, yeah, so that was a long time ago. And then there's as you can see ladders and climb up, climb down climb sideways maybe and you have to try to you don't have to try to gain all the coins like if I like I'll try to get all of them but if I get annoyed I'll just like no no I'm just going <laughs> I don't really care because the coins are just buy items from a shop and I don't really care <laughs> like, just like okay I um like the items are sometimes good, but sometimes they're like bomb and rope and stuff. And as you can see, that little tunnel is the exit. That is the exit. And you have to click L1. And I'll click it. And it turns black. And the next story. <clears throat> the journey has more di has been more difficult than I expected. I've fallen into spike pits, stepped on traps, and been attacked by monsters. Yeah, no matter what happens, I always wake up at the entrance to the mine. It's like death itself has lost its way down here. Despite the eeriness of these events, I remain focused on the task at hand, eagerly at press on pursuing my fame and fortune. Why did my voice go really deep? So yes, I'm sorry if I'm like talking and then it does something. There is a little bit of a lag. Like I'm moving left right now. And now I'm finding loop moving left on my screen so and I wish there was a lag in the mic too so it kind of like syncs up there isn't yeah so these again are a little crazy it finally shows the panel with me how to whip which I already knew and probably everyone already knew because this is like a game at the start you have free ability to roam I accidentally just took a bomb yeah Oh, there's bats. These little bats. No things do attack you. They find they seem sleepy, and then they jump out and try to kill you. Yay! I guess. <laughs> and so yeah, you have to. Don't let them. What did I? Oh yeah, I got hurt by the. Thing. So, yeah, it's thinking you use the crouch to, and then click circle, and you throw a bomb not that far. You don't chuck it. And right now the tutorial seems always the same, like the same level format, maybe a little bit different. And yeah, so they throw a rope. Quite simple. It will be easy for like a uh, two-year-old, not two-year-old. Um, I guess this is the first time it would be pretty easy to figure out all the controls. That's what I'm trying to say, but I fail. <laughs> yeah, so right now it's always the same tutorial character, but later you get a little different. See, like later, once I'm actually done with the tutorial, tutorial, I'll actually be able to play with my robot. I should name my robot. What should I name my robot? I don't know. I have to 
just name it. Post me down below, I should name it. I don't really know. Yeah. And, yeah. I don't know why I just wasted a bomb right there. I did get gold. I guess that's pretty. Oh. I only have one life. See, like right then when I said, oh, I know, that was when I got hit, but then you might have thought, why was I saying no? Yeah. Probably really weird right now. So yeah, so you can jump up and run really across these one gaps. And I guess this is kind of a guide, but I do kind of suck at the game. Because it changes. So yeah, so I'm gonna enter the next area. And the next thing. Ugh. I caught a glimpse of, of a lost paradise on the other side of the mines. At the end of the mines. How could this place exist so far underground? And what lies beyond? Cave merchants speak of even more fabulous sites further below. Ancient ruins and cities made of gold. The very idea makes my re restless heart beat faster. There. <laughs> yeah. That was basically. And now it finally shows a tutorial of how to pick up stuff, even though I already knew how, and I did it in the last tutorial. I gotta pick something up, and these rocks are the bomb. You can just smack people with them. Like, dinner. You can do a 360 no scope. And yeah, this is the merchant, finally, and do not whack him. He comes out with a shotgun and tries to kill you. It's not fun. So I'm just gonna buy all this since I have enough and I probably will need it. I don't think it goes with you. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you for your business, sir. I don't think... Sorry. I don't think it... Crap, I forgot what I was gonna say. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> I forgot. Ooh, I finally found the lady. The lady friend. So basically, you have to pick these people up, and they can die. And she gives you a kiss, and I think extra points at the end. So you do not, like, wait until she disappears into the doorway, and then go. Because I have had that happen, and then I, d I just died. And then I don't get... Oh, that's the final. I didn't see that the first time. I love crawling. Look at this. Look at this creepy crawl. Like, hey, how you doing? I'm just gonna... I'm just a head with hands. I'm gonna pick it you. <laughs> yeah. Quite fun. And I love... Like, if you, if you have a friend with you, and he or she dies, she becomes a go she or she becomes a ghost and then you have to like run away from the ghost and yeah so I'm gonna get by all these things. You're welcome. Thank you for your business sir. Thank you. So yeah. And how long has this been going on? Okay, so since this is, yeah, I probably won't I might have time for like the very first part of the next section, but I don't know, I don't know, because it's been going on for 14 minutes, and, no, no, don't wake up, yeah, and as you can see, she runs, she doesn't like your service, maybe she, maybe she's like a cave dweller, what if he does, there you go, see, as you can see, you bring it to the doorway, and I'm going to try to put this, yeah, you get a little nut. Ow! Gosh darn it. If you have a controller, of course you will. You get a nice sound. We're doing that. Okay. So I'm gonna go back and get the metal, the statue. That's it. And, yeah. And then I'll go finish this gosh darn freaking long tutorial. So, this might, hopefully I 
don't be able to throw this today. Oh, and do not. You have to throw a rock or this thing will try to kill you. Or this thing, that arrow, that's an arrow trap, that little statue. And I've died so many gosh darn times from that thing. And the best thing, it only has one arrow, which is pretty good. Instead of like, each time you pass, it has a new arrow. It's probably because I've died here like 7,000 times. And it changes each time. So yeah, so, yeah, so remember, wait until the statue is gone before clicking L1. Let's finish the tutorials. <clears throat> to whomever holds this journal, I hope you find it useful. It serves me very well, but I no longer need it. I'm descending into the caves for what I hope is the last time. I won't return without escaping the ultimate treasure. Or at least there is even greater delight to be discovered. Well, there is only one way to find out. Take this key. It will open the entrance to the mines. Follow me if you dare. Happy exploring, Yang. So yeah, that's the end of the tutorial. I'll try to do just one level of this. Like, not the whole level. Like, one section I mean, of this. Like, one one. Because, or die. Yeah, so. Whoa, it's so creepy. The walls are shifting. <laughs> Right when I begin, there's a stack of coins and a snake. A snake. Oh. And a pot. A pot? Yeah. There isn't always snakes in the pot. Shut up, lady. Okay, that's weird. I'm, I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. Yeah, sometimes, like, the lady is so gosh darn annoying. I'm not, I'm not saying like all ladies are like, all girls, ladies, whatever you want to call it, like that, but, oh, come on, I want to kill that spider, uh, eh, hi, I'll kick you, yeah, the spider's way to your right under it, and it tries to kill you, come on, yeah, probably this, so far, how far I am? Oh gosh! Yeah, I'll probably die before I finish. Okay, there's treasure up here, so I might as well get. I will grab you. I'm right here. Okay, well, join the chat of the video. Up. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, so it doesn't kill you with one, kill her with one whip, one hit with the whip, but it probably doesn't annoy her. You know what I mean? Oh, that's a skeleton. Ah, dang it! See, so yeah, I died. I didn't, wasn't able to finish the section. Hmm. So yeah, again, if you guys do want me to play more Spelunky, don't forget to smack, like, smack that like button and subscribe to the Star Shoes All Stars. And yeah, so I'll see you all later. Bye!